Hi everyone, Kremlin here for the Techies. Today I'm going to show you how to create a reflection in Corel Draw. And uh, I have a Hoctimus Prime head right here. Kudos if you know where this is from. But yeah, it's a simple process and let's get started. First thing you need to do is select everything, then go to Edit and Duplicate to create a copy, like so. Now, next thing is we're going to mirror it vertically by hitting this, and there you go, it is flipped. Now, we're going to grab this duplicate head by the node, there you go, and drag it to the bottom of the beak right here. Now it is touching at the tip there. But say we didn't want it to touch, say we wanted this logo to be like floating above our mirror, we're going to move it and hold control while you're moving it to move it like horizontally or vertically and move it down just a bit there you go now it's floating and um, final step before we do some touching up we're gonna go right here um, it's gonna have this icon that uh, but yeah we're gonna go here uh, we're gonna select transparency and drag from where we want it to be transparent to where we want it to be solid, or the other way around, I mean. And um, now we probably want to move this up just a bit and move that up since we don't want it to be solid at the top, we want it to be partially transparent. Now, it doesn't work perfectly with this image because I've like layered several things so you can kind of see them through. You can uh, fix that by doing a combination and then coloring it from there. But yeah, this works. And there you go. You can also do slant stuff, <laughs> slant transparency, of course. I don't know why you would do this in the case of a mirror. But um, yeah, there you go. That's pretty much it. Let's see how that looks. That looks pretty cool. You can also um, add like a box here, uh, like a plane for the mirror, and then shade it down. But uh, I've already covered that, and you know how to do that. So yeah, thank you for watching. This has been Kremlin for the Techies. Make sure you visit TH3Techies. Bye.